Hello, I'm glad to see you. Today we are doing our predictions for WWE Survivor Series War Games. This is your host Smurfy here to let you know we will be doing our first live reaction show on TikTok at Jeff Spoonie. I would be grateful if you would come join us tonight. After the show, we will be doing a recap to drop tomorrow. Thank you, like, and subscribe. I will drop the link to TikTok in the description box below. Smurfy out. First match is the triple threat match for the U.S. Championship between Seth Rollins, Bobby Lashley, and Austin Theory. My prediction for this match is going to be Rollins. He always pulls something out of his hat. <laughs> yep. yep. <laughs> Every time. He's going to wait off to the side like he always does. Come in at the end and do that boot stomp. Yep, right after Lashley hits the spear, he's gonna stomp Lashley. I believe that one's correct. That one's probably gonna be. It's gonna be a good match all the way through. I agree. Austin has gotten a lot better, in my own opinion, um, than what I used to think of him. I mean, he was young. So, yeah, young, green, but he's definitely. I mean, came into his own. Yeah, I mean, the thing with when he was doing that thing with Vince McMahon, he didn't want to do it, but he knew that's what he had to do to get over. Right. Now he's trying to create himself. Exactly. Right. So a little bit of spin of that with more of himself. It'd be yeah. all right. This is going to be a match that gets him over because he's not going to be the one pinned, but he's going to have a good match. Lastly, he's going to do all the work. And then... <laughs> I agree. You know... Rob's going to come out there like a snake he is. That he will. Alright, we're going to move on to our next match. Is AJ Styles versus Finn Balor. And you know I want AJ to win, but they're building up Finn Balor to take down your buddies. <laughs> you know, the other half of who's going to win the first match. <laughs> the bloodline. Yep, they're building them up to take down the bloodline, so you know he's going to beat up AJ Styles. Yeah. You know, and I'm kind of thinking this match isn't going to have a pinfall. I'm thinking it's going to be like an all-out scramble, disqualification, that way both of them still get over. I can see that because with it being Finn Balor and the Judgment Day and then AJ and the OC and they've already been... And then you have that Rey Mysterio right. thing that they just did on uh, did On, on t- oh, no, what, Twitter. On Twitter. Yeah, it was on Twitter. You know, so I'm thinking this is where all that collides and Ray and them are going to set that up and they're going to beat them and then they're going to take down the bloodline. So I think this is where this is headed. I, I can definitely see yeah. that. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. The way you're looking at it, the way they're building it up, I'm still going to predict AJ's going to win it. Just because I want AJ to win. I, my real prediction is it's going to be a disqualification on both sides or one side or the other, whatever. Okay. But if it's a pinfall, I think it's Vin Balor because they can't kill them right now with the way they're building them up. AJ Styles pinning them kills them. I gotcha. And AJ can get pinned a hundred times and still. Right, and up. still, it's, it's <laughs> AJ. <laughs> AJ, yep. Ain't nothing going to change that. The next match is going to be for the SmackDown Women's Championship. Ronda Rousey versus Shotzi Blackheart. Hey, who's going to put the SmackDown on who? <laughs> I think Ronda's going to put it down on Shotzi. Oh, yeah, especially after what happened on Friday night. That's why we're dropping it on Saturday, because we wanted to make sure <laughs> what happened on Friday night. Of course, man, they're trying to build them up as a tag team. And then Simon says, that's going to be the tag team. It's going to be the woman in the maid and all that good junk. But, yes. Yeah, no, I, this one's Ronda Rousey. It's going to be a good match, but definitely going to be Ronda Rousey. They can't. I can't see them doing it no. any other way. Until she wins the women's tag and then maybe gets upset for the world tag. Because I okay. think they want right. her to push that right now. Right. Tag. Which I think would be cool to see her tag. Well, that's why, that's why they put Sasha there. So Sasha MIA. Well, there you go. Yeah. I agree. I like it. And remember, this is all practice for our DraftKings special next month on AEW. And we're going to find out if they have the WWE stuff and we'll start doing the DraftKings for WWE or whatever other organization they have. Next match is our Women's War Games. 
Bianca Belair, Alexa Bliss, Asuka, Mia Chin, and we found out last night, Becky Lynch versus Damage Control, Nikki Cross, and Rhea Ripley. Once again, Rhea Ripley's in it. So there's going to be some type of twist so she doesn't get buried. Doesn't mean her team's going to win, but there's going to be some type of twist in here to make if it's not going to be Rhea getting pulled out by uh, AJ but, Styles, little female. Well, she's in that match too, so. Oh, well, that, that's what I'm saying. There's going to be some type of twist. If them two aren't going to go fight off and then leave it to the rest. Right. There's definitely some twist there. Oh, yeah. there's going to be. It's going to be a very interesting but match. But I see Bella uh, Bears. Yeah. yeah, I see that team losing because they're setting up for the big clash of the women's title. Then she's gonna win that. So you know how champions they lose everything up until the title match. Yeah. And that's the thing about WD, the WWE, they get so scripted that you can predict that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, for the most part, yeah, you can. Um, I'm still gonna go for the faces, the baby faces, which is Bianca's team. Yeah. So. But like I said, there's a twist in there which might. Swing it. Right. Yeah, Swing it to where the, the team wins yeah, because this, that's what it is. It's a team thing. Yeah. So, I mean, I wish they bring the old Survivor Series format back a little bit more. But that's a whole other story for another time. <laughs> but no, no, I don't think I don't think the baby face is going to win. I think it's going to be... You think it's going to be... Yeah. The bad girls. Yeah. And I think with Rhea Ripley, she's either going to get the pin or there's going to be some type of melee that... Those two are going to be gone in the back when the match gets continued that way. They See, don't... and I don't know that it will go to the back because I believe it's in a cage. It's a cage. They can go in and out of it. It's not one of the, it's the cage. It's not the cage that if you leave the cage, you win. It's the cage that you have to pin somebody in it to try to lock you in. Mm. I don't. I hadn't watched the war games, so I wasn't sure. I know they said it was a Dusty Rhodes idea. Yeah, I mean, but the same thing. Ago, was, so. What a couple of years ago, they broke the lock and knocked out the referee and got everyone in there to win. To win, I mean, yeah. it's like I said, it's a cage match. I mean, anything goes. But like I said, they're trying to build up that match between AJ Styles, Rey Mysterio, and them. They can't be neither one of them could be part of the outcome so i see some type of melee to get them out of it so the rest of them have the outcome yeah. and that's what i'm reading into the match well all i can say is we will see you yep. at the end this is where we disagree you so, bang your face i heal yes i heal it, we tend to do that from time to time i heal <laughs> all right we're gonna we're gonna go into our last match the men's war game, which is Roman Reigns in the bloodline and Sami Zayn against Drew McIntyre, Kevin Owens in the brawling brutes. The brawling brutes. <laughs> Come here. Let me straighten your nose for you. Yeah, yeah. See, here's another twist. Here goes another twist. Here goes another twist. Remember about, I don't know, about a month, a month and a half ago, Kevin Owens did his little, they're going to stab you. And well, they did the same thing. They're going to stab you. And there goes little, what did you say? Who are you talking to? Oh, so. Out the corner. So here it goes. They're going to put a beat down on who? Who do you think they're going to put a beat down on? I told you what the twist is going to be. Someone's going to jump sides. Is it going to be Kevin Owens? Or is it going to be... See, that's a tough... Andre Who's that's going to jump sides? There's, going, there's a twist here. Which twist is it going to be? I think it's going to be Oos. Oos is going to jump over there. I, I'm thinking maybe... And they're maybe. going to put the mud holes in, into the uh, Superman punch. Yeah, that'd be kind of nice. I'd like to see that. Oh, you're, you're becoming a Roman Reigns hater? He just, Acknowledge me! <laughs> that's exactly why I'm not liking him at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> but he cannot... started off as a heel. Everyone forget about that? No, I know. Uh, with the shield. Yeah. I know, but that was... I don't know. 
He's different. He's better as a by himself. He's better as a baby face. I don't know why they keep trying to make him a heel, but I agree. He whatever. Better, he is a better baby. Smack face. a WWE writer in the face. Say get <laughs> get with it. That's all I can say. But I think I think uh, Sami Zayn is gonna get back with Kevin Owens. You think and, so? Yeah, because like their reign is long. It's about at the end, but it's not them that's going to take them out, but they're going to build up and weaken them down enough so the next one, which I already explained earlier, yes. is going to take them down. And then Roman's going to take a little year off, six months off. Right. Recuperate. You know, remember, he's still dealing with aftermath. Though. It's been about five years. He probably got to go through all the checkups. Probably. All bullshit aside. Okay, well, my prediction is I think that Roman and the bloodline are going to keep it. Oh, you don't think there's going to be a little twist and Sami Zayn going to jump sides or Kevin Owens going to get on on the bloodline side? I'm telling you, there's some type of twist. So you, I could see more Kevin jumping to the bloodline side. I can't. I can't see the way they have Kevin Owens built up now and in the last past year. Yeah, well, him you know, being a coattails. They they have built him up before. Yeah, but I'm talking about how they built him now. I can't see him being a coattail jumper right now the way they built him up. I you don't can't, think so. I can't see it. I can see him pulling his own away, being really vicious, which would fit him fit over with the swap and then being vicious on Roman Reigns to teach him to weak him down. So when... Right. You know, this is where okay. I see this is going. I could be wrong. Yes, I, and I I could be wrong as well. So, so you pick you pick the heel. I pick baby face. <laughs> yes, we pick the opposite. Uh, well, one of us gonna it's be gonna right. Be interesting. One of us gonna be right. Yes. These are our predictions for tonight's Survivor Series, November twenty sixth, twenty twenty two. See you again soon, Smurfy. Out. Nine nine nine.